Hi Bethel, it's Pastor Chris here. I hope that you're having a great rest of the week. I know that all of us are getting ready for the fall, which can mean so many different things for us, whether it's decisions about whether to send their kids back and different ways that we just plan on staying safe this fall. It's a lot of different challenges for us. And I think with that is, you know, one of the decisions coming up for us, which is to actually rejoin together an in-person and live stream worship September 6th. So September 6th will be this first Sunday where we're actually going to be worshiping back together either in person or live stream live streaming and with that comes a number of different protocols that we want you to be informed about we're going to be releasing videos specific to help you know videos for how you know how to register at home uh, going through the realm or videos for what to expect when you walk in the doors so there's going to be a, just a slightly new reality with that and because we know that this is a going to be a slight change for some of us uh, we also want to invite people who are able to, to come to a night of prayer and worship next week. It's going to give us a chance to feel out a little bit, okay, how do we do this safely and wisely, but at the same time, worship together. Um, so this next week, Tuesday at 7 o'clock, it's August 25th, it's going to be a night of prayer and worship. We would ask that you register beforehand to attend. You're going to need to wear masks because this is part of the Edmonton bylaw. And we're gonna just feel out how we can do this safely with each other and we're gonna to try to inform you as best as possible. If you would like to join us for this midweek worship night next week on Tuesday, there's gonna be a registration link below this video or it's also gonna be online. And we would encourage you to register um, in groups as opposed to individuals. So if you wanna come with a few people that you consider to be your cohort or family, just register together and plan to come together and worship with us and pray with us. We'd love to have you. Hey Bethel, we're beginning a, a new year and it's a year unlike any other because of COVID-19. And yet I'm still enthusiastic and I wanna tell you why. We have two significant meetings coming up and we have two exciting developments. The first meeting is a meeting with all of the ministry leaders. We're gonna be getting together next week to ask the question, how can we in the first 90 days of the church's new year, encourage growth, and fellowship in the congregation despite COVID-19. The next meeting is a meeting with all of the council members, deacons and elders, and we're gonna be talking about how can we extend care and support to the congregation during COVID-19. And then we have those two exciting developments. And the first one is this, that we have struck up a parents team. So we do not have a children's director at this time. We're inviting applications. But in the meantime, we've gotten five very creative parents together to discuss the question, what should children's ministry look like during COVID-19? They'll be surveying the other parents and checking out what other churches are doing and of course coming with their own creative ideas. And I have heard some of these and I'm very excited about them. And then finally, Kevin Prevashewski has agreed to step in temporarily while we're waiting for a new music director to be our technical director. And Kevin is a very talented guy and his efforts will be greatly appreciated and they'll help us a lot going into this new year we have. Bethel, that's it. Uh, keep the church in your prayers. Keep us, keep one another in your love and you have a wonderful week.